What's good, y'all? It's your boy Chizzy Skywalker back again in the motherfucking flesh. So today we got the Celtics versus the Spurs. Now, you know, the Celtics got the best record in the whole NBA, so they're a tough team to beat. You got the Spurs. Then they got the, the worst record in the Western Conference, but, you know, it's always fun to see the Spurs because they got Win Manyama. So let's see how today go. You know, they got a, a great matchup. They got the Unicorn versus the Unicorn with Przingis versus Wimby. You know, Unicorn was a, a title handed to Christos Przingis a while back. So let's see how this game go. Aaron. About to tip off. Aaron Smith, Ray Acosta, the other referees. Uh, uh, Spurs one and that one. Porzingis by at least two inches, going right at Jalen Brown. Jalen Brown. Pass on door for one more to JT. Quick low catch and shoot three by JT. No, it started with the penetration from Jalen Brown. It sucks in the defense, and the Celtics are going to make extra passes. That's what they're looking for. Oh, that's a, a tough shot by Vassell. He got paid in that offseason for a reason. Oh, good spin, Jalen Brown. Jalen Brown. But you can see how about the Celtics are trying to do it. They're trying to get Malachi Branham in these mismatches. Victor again for three. Ooh. Win Manyama. Win Manyama. Can we get a win Manyama? He's shooting a career best 41% this year. Averaging career highs in points and assists. Ooh, a word with me. This time scoops it up. I mean, you know, Dan, I talk about a lot of the young guys in the league when they first get in. I, I just say they have immature shots. They can roll between him and Wimby. Shots look weak. They don't look powerful. They don't look powerful. Derek White's shot looks completely different. Jeremy underneath brings down the rebound. Sohan pushing the pace here for the Spurs again. Victor. Oh, Wimby again. Ooh. And Victor knocks down yet his second three-pointer. Six of their first 11 shots. Spurs have made five of their first 12. White underneath to Cornette, who just checked into the game. And Cornette, who's coming off his first 20 point game in two years in a spot start the other night against Toronto. Here come the Celtics with numbers up the floor. Good defense. Rounds pass deflected, comes back to him, and goes right now. Main Street to lay it up and in again. Celtics turn off this game good against the Spurs. 17 dunks on the season now for Luke Cornette. The cell has got six crosses up his old team. Oh, I won! Get off that boy! Oh, we've missed, missed our last four or five three balls, right? I mean, we continue to uh, try to play the Celtics game. Our last button was Trey Jones in the open court. Do a catch and shoot three. That was a high arc or two. Cuts back against the grain and uses his body well to finish off that play. Osmond averaging seven Orford. points on the season. Horford right. still Thunder legend. in year number 17. Oh, oh, oh. Back to Peyton Pritchard. Everybody that play for OKC, we call him Thunder Legends. But the moves on and somehow slips past Jenny Osmond. And even with Victor in the vicinity, the smallest guy on the floor puts it up and inbound. And so the Spurs get it right. Wimby again? <laughs> that boy Wimby shooting that fucking torch. Unanswered for Wimby. The Spurs back to within nine. Is the first player in double figures. He's got 13. Tatum from the mid range. You can't stop JT. Tatum, so One of the best small forwards in the NBA. Jeremy will get it back from Blake Wesley. Attacking in the paint. Oh, oh, tough down. shot. So him. Every time Tatum catches the ball, the Spurs come with a double team. Hey, I'm pretty looks so short, but he's got he looks like he's taller than me. <laughs> there on the help on those rotations yeah, exactly and you, if you're the double team you, like you said you got to come out of there quickly oh that's a tough loader both teams starting to warm up here a little bit jones spots mcdermott doug back out to victor oh i see you with me he caught he caught horford horford slip he caught him that's a real unicorn for you Little triple jab, uh, little, Pulls up over Jeremy Sohan. little jab step, triple third action by JT. Gives it up to Al Horford. Skip pass across. Pritchard in the paint, drops it off. pass, Peyton Pritchard. Pretty underneath Victor, lays it up and in. It's going to end up in your lap, right? Sohan along the baseline. Ooh, a reverse layup, I see you. Joe Mazzulla not happy with the defense. The one problem with the Spurs, though, they got to feed the hell out of Victor Wambayama. If they feed Wimby way more, they can win more games. <laughs> they miss them so much. They just need better playmakers. And a foul. 
We can't leave the best player open like that. That's JT for a motherfucking reason. Derek White been so amazing for the Celtics. For Zingad. <laughs> that unicorn. Right way to play to really challenge him. Just conceded the shot. Hasn't read the recent scouting report. I knew it was going in before he shot it. He looked real comfortable pulling that motherfucker. It's much more dangerous from the mid range as Derek White uses the window. And that's the problem. That's what Derek White does so well. Random. Trey. Sohan. Back to Malachi. Some good ball movement. He not hit that shit. I was about to say. Start of the second half. The Spurs down by 12 and now by 14 Shooter's as Jalen Brown gets in the double figures here with 10. Yeah, and you don't want the Celtics to get away from you here in the third quarter because we all know by now what our third quarters have been like. Nice job by Malachi Branham. Attacking Jalen Brown. Adam creates just enough space to get off that three. Horford rips down the offensive rebound. Brown. Now he pulls up over Jeremy Sohan and Jalen Brown now wants to get involved in the action. Yeah. Sohan. Barely grazed the iron with that shot, then Jeremy doesn't get back as Derek White leaks out with it up. Well, they had Victor in the low block, and there was no... We kind of knew how this game was going to go. Like I said, the Celtics got the best record in the whole NBA. Spurs the worst team in the Western Conference. He's just rubbing it in, screaming like that. Come on, Vassell, get it going. Game not over till it's over. One off the back iron and off Horford into victory. He's ahead of the pack. He just <laughs> that man went me like a Skywalker. That man was floating in the air like Mike. Malachi for three. <laughs> win Maniaba. Can we get a win Maniaba? All right, Derek White. I gotta avenge ourselves. Wimby we'll looking like the next thing. Well, he is, but. What you gonna do, JB? Little Tomahawk. It's becoming showtime for all the wrong reasons. He's one from one for two at the Showtime Celtics. It's just one of those games. It's over. It's over before it began. To give him the ball, but when our guys are moving too fast, they're in a hurry. Uh, you miss opportunities, your timing isn't there. Uh, so he didn't get another three ball until like the three. Jenny Osmond's first three of the night. Final second here. Oh, look, good step back. Smooth like butter. Of course. I mean, they have by 30 at the end of the third. Yeah, you already. And so there any double they already gave up. We're going to create shots for you. Nice job by Victor to save it, but he saves it right to O'Shea. Oh, and one. It's a tough basket. Cornette, the handoff, Peyton Pritchard. Throwing it up for Luke oh. Cornette, and that's three times he's gotten that action yeah, exactly. tonight. Exactly, I mean, you have Cornette catching lobs. Kenny Osmond, Trey Jones, and the cell now into the paint. Will ball fake. Oh. Splits through the defense, puts it in, and gets one more at the line. Had to work so hard. And one. Good shot, for so. Cornette, you've done enough tonight. <laughs> they just got to keep their heads up. Eventually, they're going to get better in that, that Western Conference. To have a player like Wimby on your team, a generational player, he could arguably be the best player to ever play the game. Like, he's, what is he, seven foot five? He can put the ball on the floor. He can shoot over. Once once they figure out how to really use him in that offense, it's going to be real hard to stop the Spurs because nobody can guard him. There's like nobody can guard him. It's just going to take some time. That's all it takes. I know we got high expectations because they're working, but just got to let them play it out. Gain that NBA experience. Besides the fact all the road games, in the, as they go to the East Coast, they'll see the Celtics. Yeah, they brought eight benches in. They're down by 30. That's game white. And that is how this one will wrap up tonight. 134-101 the final. As the Spurs drop the last game. Yeah, that's game. And the Celtics continue. It's a great man, Greg Popovich. He 
used to always have us scared in those Western conferences <laughs> when they had Tim Duncan and them against OKC. But again, Happy New Year's, guys. I hope you all have a great New Year's. It's two hours away from New Year's for me, so you know I'm going to be ready for that dropping the ball event. Thank you all again for watching this video. If you liked it, please drop a like for me. And like I say all the time, a subscription is free, so please subscribe. And have a great New Year's. And, oh, yeah, let's get us to 1,000 subscribers. I know we can do it. I know we can do it. Let's get us up to 1,000. We can celebrate it together. Thank you all so much again. Peace out, y'all.